The design brief for this car was very simple. Take the FT1 concept car and turn it into the most kick-ass, badass, super race car you could imagine. Uh, when we started the project, some of the keywords that came to mind were sexy, um, authentic, outrageous, um, track built. The design process on the Toyota FT1 Vision started with sketching. Uh, from sketching, we moved to a scale clay model to prove it out in, in physical form. Uh, from there, we digitally scanned it and then put it into the CAD and did all the final refinements in CAD. Well, the original FT1 was more of a sculptural concept car. That was a serious sports car, but this one is more an extreme race car where it had to look functional. Um, it had to look extremely serious and uh, aggressive. And this had more and it still had to be believable. Yeah, working on this car, uh, we really got to take that form and pull it and stretch it in different directions to try to, to emphasize these, these large fenders and this car is really low down, really high grip, really high downforce. Usually after CAD process, they still develop uh, design on clay model, sometimes hard model, but special this project, CAD data, was the final. So we have to make sure the cat data looks beautiful and perfect. And we did it. The biggest challenge in designing the Vision GT car was keeping the spirit of FT1 intact. Um, we changed a lot. And I think all the enthusiasts out there and they, the, the people that loved FT1 and now they see the Vision GT car, they'll, they'll recognize all the areas we changed and it's a lot. So we had to um, keep, keep the identity of FT1 while doing that. And we put a lot of effort, a lot of energy into really making something authentic that when all the race fans out there and all the Toyota driving fans out there uh, experience this car in GT6, they're gonna be wowed.